Homeowners, if you're thinking about renting your property out and you want to start making some calls, hiring a real estate company to place the tenant in your property, here's a simple strategy that most agents aren't going to tell you about. My name is Edgar, also Cal Homes. I am the owner and broker of the company, and I'm standing in one of our houses that we were hired to rent out, find the tenant for the property. And we use a really simple strategy that most agents are gonna tell you about to generate well over 30 applications within the first week of putting a house on the market. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull the veil back, maybe upset a couple of the agents out here in this business, but you deserve to know the truth. So here's what we do. Not only do we market the property, generate a great marketing description, take great photos, videos, that's one thing that a lot of agents aren't going to do for a rental property because there's not a lot of money to be made in a rental property. So before we get to the simple strategy, let's, let's figure out what we're trying to do here. We're trying to find you the best tenant for your property. So in order for us to do that is we have to maximize the amount of applicants that we have. So then that way you have better options, better choices. So it is important for you to figure out the best way or hire the agent that's going to figure out the best way for you to capitalize on that and get the most amount of applicants available uh, for your property to give you more choices, more options to review, more applications to review. So let's get back to the simple strategy. The simple strategy is this. What we charge, our fee for service, we're going to split right in half and we're going to give the other agent the other half. Now, I told you it was simple, but a lot of real estate companies aren't going to do that when they put your house up for rent. Why? Because like I said earlier before, there's not a whole lot of money to be made in rental properties. So rather than split that money in half and lose 50% of what they're charging, they're going to offer, sometimes they'll offer $0 to the agent. They'll go to a website like Zillow and try to place it there, Facebook Marketplace and try to place it there. There's nothing wrong with those platforms, putting your property on that. However, those shouldn't be the only platforms and you shouldn't be putting them into those platforms because you're trying to save your money right? That's going to limit the amount of views on your property, limit the amount of applications that come in for your property, which is not what you want. You want the most amount of applications. So then that way you have more options. So with that simple, and yes, it is simple strategy, we're able to generate more applications for the homeowners that we help or landlords that we help place tenants into their property. Simple, but effective, and that's what you need when you hire a real estate agent, is someone that knows how to work, knows how to negotiate, and knows how to provide you with the most amount of options that you can possibly have. That's our strategy, that's, what we, that's why this home that I'm sitting in right now, the owners are gonna have well over 30 applications to review, which means that they're gonna have plenty of options, and they're gonna be able to make a great decision and pick a great, tenant for this property, their property, that'll take care of the property and they'll be long-term just like what they were looking for. A simple strategy that you should be considering whenever you go to rent out your property. If you, if you have any more questions, feel free to reach out here on social media. Uh, you could DM me if you like. My name is Edgar, owner and broker of Also Cal Homes. Been in the business since 2001 two decades worth of experience and then some, and I'd love to share it with you. Have a great